Here is their website. There are some examples of their created bio page by some users. There are their price tables. You can see their plans and choose each one that is suitable for your needs and business. Again, there are some examples of bio pages. I sign into my account. After you have signed up, this is your account setting. Here you can see your email, your password, your security section and your social network sections. You can connect your Facebook or Google account to tap link. This is share access that you can access it from here or here. And your profiles. You can create a new profile or one profile. You can have some pages or some profiles. This is your page settings. But this is your account settings. Page settings includes page language, page currency. There are some options that are available for business plan and pro plan, such as SEO, HTML, custom domains. You can add some advanced like Facebook Pixels, Google Analytics, MailChimp. These are their categories. First, you need to create a page. You can choose one of these pre-made templates or you can create your own from scratch. I want to create my own from scratch. There are some hints that tell you what to do. Here you can change the orders of blocks. You can change a profile picture or avatar picture. These are the profile picture size. Small, very small, large, x large. I want to upload my logo. I'm satisfied with the picture. Click on save changes. Here we can duplicate it or delete it if you are not satisfied with it. This is the editor mode and view mode. These are page settings again. You can see your page in phone mode, desktop mode. You can choose where the blocks are located at top, center or down. Let's add some blocks. There are six blocks for free plan. The rest of blocks are available for pro version and business version. Oh, it's duplicated. I need one of them. So I delete it. Click on action and press delete. It will be deleted. I want to add some links and dividers or maybe let's start with text and put my username or your name or your business name, your store name, everything you are 
creating a page for it. These are the text settings. These are the section settings. You can customize them if you want to your need based on your needs. I'm satisfied with it. Make it bigger, save changes. Oh, it's on left. I want to make it on. I want to make it in the center. Now it's in the center. You can change the color, make it bold. It's a good. Add another block and text, and I want to enter my description or your bio. Saving changes. Oh, again, it's on the left. I want to make it in center. It's okay. Click on save changes and it's done. You can add your links, but for social links, you need to be a pro version users. But you can add your social media links here and put a divider between your social media accounts and other links. Like what I do here. First of all, I put my website. You can put your store website or business website. Put your website URL here. Click on save changes and done. Here you can add a thumbnail for your link. There are some pre-made icons. If you want to add an image, it's not available in free version. You can choose from icons. Let's search for a website icon. There is nothing here. Let's search for site. Again, nothing. In the settings section, you can make your links animated. These are some animation types, you can choose one of them. And the uh, section settings. You can change the section colors, section fonts, section background. You can play around with them and change as the way you want. These are your links, analytics. Add another block. I want to add another link. For example, social media account Facebook. Face your Facebook page. And it's in desktop mode. And it's in phone mode. The blocks are at the bottom. The blocks are at in the center. And the blocks are on the top of the page. You can enter a name for your page. For example, bio page. And for page link, you need to enter your username and they gave you a link. It also give, a, give you a QR code. When you are done with your page, click on publish. 
and it gives you a link. This is your bio page link or your bio link that you can put it in everywhere that is important to you. You put your username here and your bio link will be created. This is your bio page QR code and if you want to embed this bio page in your website, you should copy this HTML code and put it in your website. I want to put my username here click on connect and your buy link is created you can share it on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook or directly copy it and paste it in your bio in a statistics section you can see your page analytics in leads you can see how many of your clicks has been turned into leads and in the design section you can choose a theme for your page such as light mode rounded circles pattern background i choose this one And my page looks like this. Click on publish and done. 